just like Christian Gamboa. Who's Marty, up don't there? talk about him. Hey, hey, Christian Gamboa up there to go to one center. Now, we found out who the guy was in the We Believe jersey when the Warriors went up 69-62. And ABC panned that camera onto him, and he was a vibe. I felt his energy from the NBC studios. Christian Gamboa, we caught the guy in the Warriors We Believe jersey with the number 30 on Christian. Good morning. Good morning, man. Thanks for having me. Anytime, man. This is you. We tracked you down. We made sure that was you. Tell us about that vibe up there at Dakota One Center. You up there representing, and we know you're about that life. We know why we know you're about that life, because you went up there with the jersey on, no T-shirt underneath, and you had the three gold chains on, looking like a player. <laughs> man, that was, like, one of the best feelings in the world. Like, we went up five, and then he came back down, and Steph did his magic, was being a magician again, and... I, was, I just couldn't, I had, I just let it all loose, let it all out and let them hear me. I just felt like it was like the Rorico days and, I know, it kind of brought me back to like listening to all those Kings fans. They, they gave it all and every time they scored or turn, turnover, it just, that's how it used to be and I wish Chase Center was like that and I hope game one we could bring all that feelings back, let them hear, um, hear everything that we got so that we could just disrupt all the communication that the Lakers are trying to give each other. I want to. We we need this. We need this game. It's very very important. Mm -hmm. All right, I want I want to rapid fire some of these because you're probably the most famous Warrior fan right now. Currently, where are you from? Where where were you? Where did you grow up? I'm I'm from Union City. Nice, just like just like Guru. All right, did you go to the game by yourself? Because I didn't see any other Warrior fans around you. No, I was there with my girlfriend, but she was like, "Stop!" You know, she's like one of those. I don't. No, you're 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 too much. And I'm like, no, 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 no. I'm 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 let them hear it. And I, I was like, it. had GP two over there. He was saying what's up, and all those other trainers are like, you know, trying to like amp me up. I was already amp. We can't amp you no more. All buttons are all gone. It was just I'm gone. Let's go. All right, so so uh, explain to me what the vibe was like heading into that arena. Were they giving you crap as you're walking in? You know, obviously the Warriors go on a run in that second half. How did the vibe change throughout the day? They got real quiet real quick, um, <laughs> especially that young man right behind me. And, like, in a part, I said, look, I don't mean, mean no disrespect. I will never say anything towards you. I'm just cheering for my team. Yeah. Came to Chase Center. I'm going to let you cheer. Just don't be disrespectful. If I'm too much, pull me aside. Let me know. But they're cool. Uh, they're, like, they're, they're really, really, like, welcoming, if you want to believe it. But I was one of very, like, there was probably out of 19,000 fans, there was probably like a thousand of us really spread out, wow. not even close by each other. And wow. um, I was just pumped, man. Like I do that all the time. If I'm there, if I can afford it in the budget, I'm I'm going, man. This is like once in a lifetime game seven, and I can't ask for nothing more. And especially to see Steph drop fifty chicken Ooh. nuggets on them. Chicken Ooh, nuggets. 50 chicken nuggets, 50 burgers for everybody. Talking to Christian Gamboa from Union City. He's up there to go to one center. We're off trying to figure out who that fan was who was yelling in the sky with, the with that We Believe jersey, the orange one, about that life. And it's Christian Gamboa. We have him on the air right now on the morning roster. All right, now tell me about the walk out of go to one center after winning game seven and watching Steph Curry drop 50 and quiet that crowd. Tell me what the walk out of the arena was like Sunday. It was it was very calm. Um, it well, I, the last thing I'll be honest, I was drinking a little too much, <laughs> and you could just see like all the blood vessels just popping out of my face. And I just remember GP two pointing at me, and I was like, "What?" And then my girl was like, "I think he wants to sign something." I was like, "Okay," and I just couldn't find my pen. But after that, uh, I walked out, and I don't remember anything after that. Well, I think. Um, you don't remember oh, anything you was loaded? I, I kind of love that. Hey, did, Christian, did you drive back to the bay that day? Yeah, did you drive back? I was dehydrated. Yes. Oh, gotcha. Yeah. gotcha. I know that move. Well, Christian, when, when did you realize that you went viral? Was it right. that moment? Was your phone blowing up? Did you check out when you got home and sobered up? Was it the next morning? Like, you became not only a meme, you became like the mascot. Like, 40 water step to the left. You know, uh, thunder step to the left. Christian yeah, is now I'm, the I'm, warrior I'm, mascot. <laughs> when did you realize that? When did your phone start blowing up? Um, To be honest, it was probably around 11 a.m. the next morning because, like I said, I didn't get home from the hospital until, like, midnight. The hospital? The hospital? You went to the hospital? Yeah. No no lie. I I was literally in the hospital with dehydration, and um, <laughs> I just, bro, like, I, 
I, I ran out of energy. <laughs> P- Pedialyte, <laughs> homie. Dude, you got you got to hydrate. Hey, yo. It was sixty nine, sixty two. You were a mood. I was like, it's going to be the last. Electrolyte. You are a legend. So you wake up in the hospital the next day, <laughs> and your, phone's and your phone up. has eight thousand. Me- How many missed messages did you have? Um, I'm not that popular. I probably had like a, like around 110. Oh no, nah, that's more than Shasky. Yeah, that's more than Shasky yeah, ever did, had. Did you, are, are you on Twitter? Was it on Instagram? Like, how did you find out first? Um, a lot of people have been messaging me, um, sending me little clips and links, and I don't have a Twitter. I created a Twitter last night, oh. and I started con- commenting to people and uh, commenting and just showing a little, you know, let's go Dubs and thumbs up and. A more hearts and thunder signs. What, what's your Twitter account? Yeah, right I'm now? following you right now, homie. What was that? What's, what's your, your Twitter account? What's your username? What's your handle? I don't even know how to do that. Let uh, me. What am I looking for? That, that is, what is just, your just name? Just a Twitter on, name. On just Twitter. a Twitter name. Yeah, yeah. It says Christian Gamboa. Uh, because I I saw something strength. Let's dub them strength in numbers. My at is S T N G T H I N U M R S, bro. Uh, yeah. Hi, text, text. Yeah, you got to text producers. one of us. Yeah, we're, we're, we're so lost. We're, 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 so we're, now let me ask you this. Is your in girlfriend embarrassed is or is she more impressed now that you're a celebrity? Uh, I don't think she's impressed. I don't. She's hard to impress, man. She's real tough. Damn. Uh, Damn women. Damn. Damn she, she just more or less, she doesn't want, she doesn't like the attention, which is cool. Kind of offsets each other, but I'm, I'm out there. I like to rep my team, my squad. And go. I'll keep doing so when we are draw back in the days with Beedrins and yep. Larry Hughes mm-hmm. and Agent Zero. Back, I go way back. Oh, yeah, you're a real Hibachi. one. You're a real one, Christian. You're a real one. So where are you watching right. game one? How does this – are we beating the Lakers? Because I got the Warriors winning in six. I almost picked them in five. I, I'll i be bold and say we got them in five if Steph keep running around. Huh. There we go. You know what time it is. Nobody, do we, I don't feel LeBron. How do we I know get you, don't. you to the game th- this week? How do we get you to one of these games? Uh, I don't. I don't know. I mean, I'm willing to pay. I'm not looking for a handout. I just Ticketmaster need to chill out with all those fees. Like Feel me? fifty dollars in fees is like, yeah. how is that not right? Like, well, you got to talk to Willard. Uh, game time. You know, he got the Game Time app. That's how he gets on. That's where I got it from. Game Time app. Oh, well, they had all the fees. Like a live well, read. well, you got to get Warriors.com. One hundred percent authentic. They don't have oh, any of those game keys. Warriors.com. <laughs> good, good pivot. Right. <laughs> I used to be a season ticket holder in, at Oracle. That's why. Um, Chase has got a little too, too much. It is a little um, too much. Well, Christian, right. Christian, awesome you're a stuff, legend. You went to the Thank you hey, so much you're for gonna calling be a nominee. Us. So we have the Doobie Awards every year, every Christmas time here on the Morning Rose. You're going to be a nominee for Interview of the Year yes. for a Doobie yeah. Award. Just know Mark that. It. You're an absolute legend. When you scream, I, I swear to God, when it was 69-62 and they panned the camera on to you and you was there, you were an entire vibe. You felt like everybody. It was like you were screaming for Dub Nation. And I love seeing that. And the Warriors go out and roll the Kings in Game 7. You got to watch Curry drop 50, which you don't even remember because you spent the night in the hospital. What a story for you. What a story. It's incredible. Christian, have a good day, Christian, man. Christian, I love you, bro. All right, man. Take care. Thank you. Hey, get, wait, wait, before you go, give me one yeah. of those let's goes like you did on television. Come on. All right. Let's go! Woo! Let's go, Christian! That's what it took to get you going. Let's go! That was a vibe. That was a vibe. What a legend. Christian Gamboa? Home